The Five Kassen Plaza is significantly less crowded now, but it's still too early to relax. This is a serious matter, and we must remain vigilant. Is that clear? Yes, ma'am. Hey, Sarah! Oh, it's you. Do you have something to report? Nothing to report. Really? Good. The Tenryo Commission has a responsibility to ensure public order and security during the Iridori Festival. If anything comes up, come to me. Oh, you look really busy. Has something serious happened? Nothing serious, really. We've just received a lot of reports in the past few days over things like line cutting, reselling goods at inflated prices, even troublemakers hogging the photo board. All minor incidents. But it all adds up to create a lot of work for a lot of people. Sounds tough. Still, I take the fact that so many people are turning to us for assistance as a sign that the Tenryo Commission is gradually regaining the people's trust. The Shogun gave us orders to provide security at the Iridori Festival. This is a rare chance to change people's perception of the Tenryo Commission, so we cannot afford to slip up. Even if it's tiring work, we must rise to the challenge. Well, no matter how busy you are, at least you still found some time to come here and buy an almighty Shogun figurine, right? We want to buy one too! What do you mean, figurine? <clears throat> I'm just patrolling these parts. In fact, I was just about to leave. <laughs> no need to be shy. Actually, Miku told us that you got up super early this one time to make sure you could be the first in line to buy one of these figurines. That Lady Gucci, how could she disclose... <sighs> Never mind. To be clear, I have no intention to hide that which I do out of reverence alone. But there is one thing you must be corrected on. Oh? What is it? That is not a figurine. It's a statue of Her Excellency, the Almighty Narukami Agosho, God of Thunder. Do I make myself clear? Got it! This particular statue of Her Excellency, the Almighty Narukami Agosho, God of Thunder, is a brand new addition. There will only be 300 available in this batch, and there is a limit of one per customer. Many people have been lining up since well before dawn to acquire one. I'm afraid if you're only showing up now, you're probably too late. Oh, really? So... So you definitely must have gotten here pretty early, too, then. Did you manage to get one yet? Normally, of course, I would come to purchase one myself. But on this occasion, my duties at the Iridori Festival had to take priority. We are required to report for duty long before the shops open. It is regrettable, but I had no choice but to forego the chance this time. Aw, what a shame. So instead, I had someone purchase one on my behalf. Oh, right! Wait, didn't you say they're limited to one per customer? This figurine is super popular. It must be pretty tough to find someone happy to buy one for you and not for themselves. I anticipated the same at first, but Lady Gujiyae found a professional to assist me, saying she appreciated our tireless efforts during the festival period. I don't know who the professional is. I assume it would be either someone from the Grand Narukami Shrine or from the Yashiro Commission. But I did not ask. Given the time, I believe they should have completed the purchase by now. I am fortunate to have had Lady Guji's help this time. I likely would have struggled to find a candidate on my own. As well as being willing, they would need to be an early riser. And also tall enough to beat the crowds to the top shelf items. Early riser and tall. <laughs> hmm? What was that sound? Probably just the wind. Really? Well, never mind. I have been here long enough. It's time for me to head to my next patrol zone. Stay safe during the Iridori Festival. Sayu, what are you doing here? Oh, wait! Are you the professional? 
Shh, quiet. She might still be in earshot. Sayu, have you been slacking off again? No way. I've been here since last night so I could buy a figurine. But after waiting and waiting, my eyes started to feel real droopy. And I only meant to take a short nap, a really quick one. In short, you overslept. Oh, if I don't buy one of these figurines, the Tenryu Commission Tangle will lock me up for life. Surely not. Sheesh, goodness knows what Miko told you. I guess my only hope now is to sacrifice my salary for this month and buy one off of someone who got here in time. I'm good at driving a hard bargain. Really? Great! Then, here's my salary. Please don't spend it all. Wait, we go around? Who am I supposed to ask? You? Oh, just you? Huh, you didn't manage to get one either? That's strange. When I came to line up this morning, I checked with my friend who'd already bought one. She'd been lining up since before sunrise, and she was around the 100th in line. I was only 150 places behind her, so surely I should have gotten one. Hmm, something's wrong here. I'm gonna go ask the shopkeeper for an explanation. Okay. So, there's a shortage. There's definitely a shortage. You're not part of this quest. I'm ignoring you. Now let me see the passer buyers. You, Junpei. <laughs> Why so glum? Didn't manage to get your hands on a statue of her excellency, the almighty Narukami Gosho, God of Thunder, by any chance? Sell it? Huh. I ain't selling. Not after all the effort I put in to get a hold of this. Go ask someone else. Ha, huh, rude. Alright, and look for the third one. I don't see any more... I don't see anybody else. Oh, I guess you. I don't know, I skipped you. <sighs> after coming all this way to Inazuma, and especially getting up early, I still walk away empty-handed. The first batch was smaller than I expected. And who knows when the next batch will come out? Well, since I'm here now, I guess I should buy some other souvenir instead. Dang. You ask around the area, but to no avail. I can't believe it. I am definitely done for this time. A whole load of people are saying they didn't manage to get one. Did the shopkeepers get the count wrong or something? Hmm. Oh, why don't we go ask at a Pekasu? Hmm. Might as well. I guess there's nothing to lose. Terribly sorry. I was otherwise occupied this morning and had someone else watch the shop. So I don't know all the details, but according to our records, we did sell the full 300. Hey, what about those ones at the back? Aren't they for sale? I'm sorry, those are... Those are display only. Please don't be too disappointed. We're only selling a limited number of these statues at the festival, and this was only the first batch. Please rest assured, you will all have the chance to purchase one in the future. But when will the next batch be ready? Also, this poor guy came all the way from Mondstadt. He got here earlier than me and was at least 50 places ahead of me. Even he didn't get one. How do you explain these numbers? Look, I don't know a whole lot about Inazuman festivals, but they do seem to have sold out pretty quickly. I'm terribly sorry, but I've triple-checked the sales records for this morning, and everything seems to be accounted for. Hmm... Why don't we get the Tenryo Commission to investigate this? The... the Tenryo Commission? No, no way. Hmm? Sorry, who are you? This is a professional from the Yashiro Commission. Oh, are you saying this falls under the Yashiro Commission's jurisdiction? Um, um, yeah, it does. We will follow up on this matter, so... So there's no need to go to the Tenryo Commission. They're busy enough as it is. <laughs> uh, that's weird. How come Sai is so motivated to work all of a sudden? Shh. If the Tenryo Commission finds out about this, Kujo Sara will come ask me about it. And then, she'll find out that I didn't buy her figurine. And... She technically should have been the first in line. Anyway, we can't get the Tenryo Commission involved. Not unless there's no other way. Huh. Well, since someone's already on the case, I suppose I'll just wait for the findings. <sighs> since I came all this way and didn't get a figurine, 
I guess I might as well look at what else is available. Thank you both for your understanding. We will make an announcement as soon as the results of the investigation come out. Hmm. So we're supposed to be investigating, but we don't have any leads at all. Oh, maybe the customers really did make a mistake with the count. If only we had a witness who'd been here the whole time. Technically, someone was here the whole time. You mean me? Sorry, I was asleep. Did you hear anything in your sleep? Did I hear anything? Uh, let me think. <sighs> I'll take these, please. Thank you for your patronage. Please come again. Thank you, patronage. Oh, yeah. Now I remember. I heard thank you for your patronage over and over again this morning. Huh? How many times? 300? Uh, I mean, I... You don't have to give an exact number. Um... 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 I got it! There were at least 16 snores between each thank you for your patronage. That's not how you count it! 16 snores should be about one minute. And if we add on the time for moving the boxes and stocking the shelves... It should take at least five hours to sell everything. Right. Sales only started about four hours ago, so there's definitely a problem with the amount. But, which means, even though I only woke up just now, I still have a chance of getting my hands on one. Maybe. A minuscule chance, but yes, you're not wrong. Well, anyway, maybe I failed my mission because a bad guy did something tricky, not because I was being lazy. So then, who's the bad guy? Hmm, well, the shelf was pretty strict with this promotion. Not only was there a one per customer limit, they even checked people's identity. So there's no way anyone could have bought more than one. No wonder each transaction took so long. And with SARS people patrolling the area, no one could have cut the line, right? By process of elimination. The remaining option is... No good. They definitely try to find a way to sell the figurines at a higher price. Let's go ask the guy who says he had to put in a lot of effort to get a hold of one. Maybe he knows something. Huh? You want to know how I got my hands on the statue? <laughs> Dream on. Huh? Why? It's not like we're trying to buy yours off you. It's a no, okay? No more questions. Huh? How come? A staff member sold it to you. How... how did you know? We're professionals. Huh? Oh, oh, right. Yeah, we are professionals. Okay, fine. Since you guessed it anyway. But let me be clear. Don't spread this around. I came here bright and early to line up. But the first batch of statues sold out almost immediately. I wasn't very happy about that, so I went around to the back door of a Pegasus to see if I could find a shop assistant to ask about when the next batch would be coming out. To my surprise, I saw him moving boxes and boxes worth of statues out of the store. Needless to say, I was all ready to march up and demand to know what was going on. But... He gave you a figurine to keep you quiet? Well, uh, yes. Uh, but I paid the shop assistant full price for it. So it was still a legitimate transaction. It's not for you to decide whether it was a legitimate transaction or not. Huh? It's... the Tenryo Commission? The Tenryo Commission has received reports that someone has been hoarding goods to resell at extortionate prices. Now, these are not classed as strategic materials, so some amount of price fluctuation is expected in the market. However... It is against the law for a staff member to abuse their position to forge sales records and misappropriate goods. We have already investigated the situation at a Pekusu. The sales records are correct, but in the cash box, there are two bags in which most of the cash has been replaced with stones. But... but how can this be? Please hand over your statue of Her Excellency, the Almighty Narukami Ogosho, God of Thunder, as evidence. We will compensate you for your loss once we catch the individual responsible. Ugh, fine. So this guy was cooking the books. Never saw that coming. Junpei hands over the statue. You guys figured this out pretty quickly, Sa. 
Zara? In fact, we were only just tipped off. We're still working on the logistics of the arrest operation. Hmm? Who's this? Thanks. I've been spotted. This is Sayu. Oh, you must be the professional Lady Guji hired. I was just wondering why I hadn't seen you yet. Um, we... we were... investigating the missing figurines. Oh, I mean, statues of Her Excellency, the almighty Narukami Okosho, God of Thunder. Is that so? Then, thank you. The Tenryo Commission will take over from here. Rest assured, we will get to the bottom of the matter. Uh... Hmm? Um, um... So, uh... About your statue... Sayu has been lining up since last night. Really? Thank you. So, where is the statue of Her Excellency, the almighty Narukami Agosho, God of Thunder? But she saw someone misappropriating the statues. Oh! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Sayu spent the whole night investigating the staff. So, by the time she got back, she was just too late to buy one. Yeah, right! I definitely would have made it back in time to buy one, if only it hadn't been for someone stealing the statues. I see. So in the end, you did not manage to purchase a statue, correct? Uh... <laughs> I'm sorry. Don't blame yourself. The criminal is the one responsible here. The important thing now is to devise a plan to bring him to justice as swiftly as possible. Mm-hmm. According to the intelligence, the suspect has already started reselling the statues near the festival venue. But he is lying low and operating very discreetly. If we confront him head on, he's likely to destroy the evidence and dash. Instead, we will seek to quietly surround him. But in order to achieve this, we will require one person to approach and distract him. Since you've spent the whole night thoroughly investigating this situation, I can think of no one else more suitable to gain his trust than you. Would you be willing to help the Tenryo Commission one final time? What? Uh, <laughs> right. Leave it to us. <laughs> hmm? Who introduced you? I'm trying to keep a low profile here, so I'm afraid I don't take any new business except for referrals by existing customers. Who we were referred to by the one who caught you stealing the statues? That guy. Fine. He did technically buy from me, I suppose. But let me be clear. This product is highly sought after right now. I can't sell to you at the same price he paid. The price has gone up again? But it's only been a few hours! <laughs> well, you can take it or leave it. Believe me, there's plenty more room for upwards mobility on the price. It just so happens to be in my interest to get these off my hands sooner rather than later. Besides... <laughs> Good luck trying to find anyone else out there selling. Hmm. We gotta keep negotiating as long as we can. Can you give me a little discount? <sighs> I don't have time for this. Just name your price. Oh, uh, hell no. Alright, that's it. We're going as cheap as we can. Hey, at that price, why don't you just ask me to give it to you for free? Am I actually give you money? Alright, we're gonna do the midpoint. This is an offer you can't refuse. Deal. Let's schedule a time for you to pick up the product. Hold on. Paimon thinks that the price is still a little too high. You think that's high? <laughs> It'll be at least double that in a few days. You think this is a game or something? If you're not serious about buying, quit wasting my time. I should be moving on to my next location by now. Not stuck here arguing with you. The next location you move to will be the police station. You are under arrest for abusing your position for personal gain and falsifying accounts. Do not attempt to resist. The evidence is indisputable. The Tenryo Commission? When did you... Wait, all that negotiating... <laughs> Stick him up! The Tenryo Commission escort the shop assistant back to the police station. Thank you for your help. The culprit has revealed the location where he stashed the statues, and we have sent people to collect them. So once Epekusu has counted the goods and stuffed the shelves, we can get back in the line to buy one, right? This time, I must complete my mission. 
I'm afraid it's not that simple. The stolen goods will have to be kept as evidence at the police station for some time. They will not be available for purchase in the immediate future. Paimon can't believe it! I would be grateful if you could inform the shopkeeper about this. I should return to the station and see how things are going. I see. Uh, thank you. We'll make a compensation plan and announce it as soon as possible. Okay, well see you then. Wait, hold on. Although this statue of Her Excellency, the Almighty Narukami Ogosho, God of Thunder, was only intended as a display item, now that I think about it, why don't you have it as a gesture of my gratitude? After all, it was our negligence that caused trouble for you all on this occasion. This is just a small gift, a mere token, but I do hope you can accept it. <laughs> really? Shall we give this to Sarah? Sounds good. As long as we give this to Sarah, my mission will be completed. Uh-oh. I've been so nervous all day, and now I can finally relax. I feel really tired all of a sudden. Please, take this figurine to the police station. <sighs> Saw you. Signing out. Sarah! Look what we brought you! Oh. Is this...? You take out the statue and explain what happened. We just grabbed it and came straight here! But now that Paimon takes a closer look at it, it's really well made! Of course. This is a prototype designed by Yae Publishing House's top artist and crafted by the most skilled lacquerware master in Inazuma City. Otherwise, how could one hope to capture even one thousandth of the Almighty Shogun's majesty? Let alone maintain it. To do that, you must buy a special kind of shrine and worship it properly. It's also essential to clean it often to avoid a buildup of dust. And it's best practice to hire a craftsman to perform regular maintenance. Sara! Sara! Hmm? What's wrong? These are the five principles for maintenance of the statue of Her Excellency, the Almighty Narukami Agosho, God of Thunder. And I haven't even finished explaining the first one. I never knew there was such a fuss over these tiny figurines. <laughs> I'm surprised Miko never mentioned it to me. Y Your Excellency! This is most unexpected. I had some spare time, so I decided to come out for a stroll. Oh, did you buy this figurine yourself? I... it's... it was... it was him. Hey, what? Yep, it was me. Oh, I didn't know you liked little trinkets like these. Your Excellency, I've yet to finish the defense arrangements for the Iridori Festival. Please excuse me. Very well, thank you. Sarah leaves, her head lowered. Watching Sarah leave, she looked kinda sad. I have another such figurine in Tenshukaku, a sample sent by Yai Publishing House. I don't need it, so I think I'll gift it to you. But we already have one. I shall not go back on my word. I have committed to giving it to you. What you choose to do with it is your business. You're quite free to give it to somebody else, if you wish. Or to save you the trouble, I can have someone from Tenshukaku deliver it directly. But, of course, your name will have to be written as the sender. <sighs> Why does all this have to be so complicated? Paimon. <clears throat> Just put Baka as the sender. Good. I'll have someone attend to this shortly. Oh. And I wish you a pleasant and enjoyable Irodori Festival. Aren't you two even a little curious about what interesting things you might see at the festival? A signed first edition is going to become quite the collectible. I've got to get my hands on a copy. I've been here since last night so I could buy a figurine. 